All right, ready? So, question one has a dog walker, right? So he's walking his dog, right? Uh, and uh, he's got this tree. things about those. So we're gonna I'm gonna give you a, a little example about here is a this is what I call a 30. So instead of that 45 right there gonna be 90. This would be 45 45 this is 90 yeah but you see what the 30s at trust me away from the 30 on the back side 45 would be 90. This would still be 90. This, tree, this one Oh, that's a whole nother level of, uh, not really. It would be 180 minus 45, which would be like, uh, 135. Okay. So, um, recording? Yeah. Okay, so we need the 30, 60, 90 triangle. We need the correlation of, this is what we call X. This is what we call x square root 3, and this is 2x, okay? And that goes for every single 30, 60, 90 triangle, okay? So for any 30, 60, 90 triangle, if I know this is 5, then this is 5 square root 3, and this is 10, because 2 times 5. If this is 18, then this is 36, and this is 18 square root 3. It's real simple, right? So I, I have to learn this before I can know these. Does that make sense? If I know this, it's cake. All right? The other one is this guy. Okay? This is the 45-45 where we have x, x, and x square root 2. Okay? So once we know these, we're solid. Okay? So... With, uh, with the dog walker, they tell us, they said, uh, how far is the dog walker from the tree if the tree is 10 feet from the telephone pole? So they're saying hey, the tree is 10 feet from the telephone pole. So they're saying so this distance right here is 10 feet, right? And they want to know how far is this. They want to know how, how long that is. Okay? Well, that's not that bad. Because this is a 45-45, right? So what do we know about 45-45? What do we know? These are equal, right? So that means this has to be 10, right? Once I know that, I know this length is 20, right? Because that's 2x. I know this length is 10 square root 2, right? Which means that this length right here, this whole length, is this length, right? So it'd be 10 square root Right? So let's go through that one more time. Right? First of all, 10, this is x. This is x, then that's x, then that's 10. Right? Alright? Then what's this? The length of this. It's going to be x square root 2. If this is 10, then it has to be 10 square root 2. Does that make sense? If this is 10. And alike sides. Yep. As long as we know what this is, then we know what this is. That's simple, right? Now, once we know what this is, if this is 10, then this long one is 2 times 10, which is how much? All right, then that's 20. 
But how, how, how much is this if x is 10? 10 square root 3. 10 square roots of 3. And that's what it is. Just, just like this is 10 square root 2, this is 10 square root 3. That's it. So this whole length is 10 square root 3. But I don't want to know the whole length. I just want to know this part. So let me ask you. If this part was 15, and this part was 7, how much is this part? 8. Now, see? Was it hard? Right? Easy, right? This would be 8, right? No different. This is no different, except it's harder. <laughs> right? Because what's the whole? It's not 15, it's 10 square root 3, right? What are we taking away? How did you get 8? You took 7 away from 15, right? Well, we're going to take 7, or in this case, 10 away from this. There it is. Now you can plug it in your calculator and get some funky number, right? But that's still this, right? So if you take the square root of 3, right? I bet this makes a lot more sense when we leave it in terms of like real numbers. So let's go square root of 3. That's 1.73 blah blah blah, right? Times 10, guess how much that's going to be? It's 17 blah blah blah, right? Times 10. Oh yeah, 17 blah blah blah. blah. So 17.32 let's say. And then I'll take away 10 from it, how much do you think that's going to be? How about 7 blah blah blah? Because you took seven away from the seventeen, Oops. right? That's it. That's all you're doing. It's cake. See that over there? Yeah. Who did that? The one who loves me. I also got a lot of other bananas. All right, we good. Yeah. Get it. You can do that on your, your test, right? Okay, moving on.